please one eye on the one. Let the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart be acceptable in thy sight, O Lord, my strength and my redeemer. I have a praise this morning. I'm going to live so God can use me. For all I can, we have a very abbreviated service as we can pass by our church conference. I'm going to ask that brother. Father, for the William Father, would you lead us in our invocation this morning? Thank you, sir. Uh, our scripture lesson is going to be coming from Philippians. Our announcement as we get close to all. We're glad to have the director of Christian education for the Eighth Episcopal District, the Reverend Dr. Danielle Lee Pruitt, with us on this morning. I give you a hand. Come on, let's join I'm gonna live so God can use me. Anywhere, Lord, anytime. Let us lift our arms and let's sing this great hymn of the church. Oh, I'm gonna live so God can use me. Anywhere, Lord, anytime. Oh, I'm gonna live so.
Father, once more and again. Here come a few of thy own and we serve. We didn't come for form and neither fashion. And neither no outside show to this unfriendly world. But Father, we come this morning to give thee thanks and most humble thanks for just being so good and so kind to bringing us from a mighty long way up until this present time. As we come, Father, we ask you to please serve. Be around us your strong arm of protection and keep us from all great harm and danger. Guide us in the way that you would have us to go and teach us the things that you would have us to do. Father, we come not because we are so holy and neither because we are so righteous, but we just come to say thank you. Thank you, for we did some of the things that you told us not to do. Things that you told us to do, we left undone. We come this morning and ask you to please stop, forgive us, O oh God, and throw it in the seas of forgiveness, for I will never rise against us again. We come this morning, Father, asking you to look on the pastor this morning and bless him with the blessing that you see he stand in need. Guide him in a way that he would have him to go. Teach him, O oh God, so that he will teach us, O oh yeah, God, yeah. to be good fathers that we did thy will. Please have mercy. We come this morning, Father, because we need you. Just can't get down to doubt. Father, we need you in Union Bethlehem this morning. Ask you to take care of the business, Father. You know the Bible. You know the whole body we do, Father. We know that you can guide us and teach us the way that you would have us to go. Yes, yes. We come, Father, this morning and ask you to look on the choir this morning. Yes. Bless the choir with the blessing that you see they stand in need. Yes. Ask you to look on the drum this morning. Yes. Bless him, O oh God, with the blessing that you see him stand in need. Yes. Then, Father, we ask you to look on the elders this morning. Yes. Bless them with the blessing that you see them standing in need. Yes. Then, Father, we ask you to look on the way of obligation this morning. Yes. Ask you, O oh God, to bless us, O oh God, with the blessing that you see we stand in need. Yes. We stand in need of blessing this morning. Bless us, O oh God. Stand by us, O oh Father. We ask you a special blessing for Obama this morning. Yeah. The our president, O oh Father. Build a fence around him. Keep a friends around him. Yeah. While you keep him from all the harm and death. Yeah. Oh God, we need you. We need you, Father. Have mercy, O oh God. Please sir, have mercy. Go with us and stand by. You be our help, O oh God, in a time of trouble, O oh God. Please yes. have mercy. Thank you, then, Father, then, Father, when it's all over here, yes. as you, my heavenly Father, don't leave us, but just give us a place somewhere in thy hand. Yes. Need another blessing, we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. 